Today, members of the community rallied to end gun violence in honor of Zion Gibbs. He is the seven-year-old boy who was killed in his home by a stray bullet from a drive-by shooting in Fayetteville. WRL's Gilbert Bay spoke with his mother about seeking justice in his death. An archway of balloons and a tent cover the entrance to this home on Danish Drive. It's where seven-year-old Zion Gibbs lived. It's also where he died on June 7th when a stray bullet from a drive-by shooting crashed through a window and struck him in the head. In honor of my son, I have to keep his memory alive. And he deserves justice and we're going to get it. Police released video of a gray vehicle seen in the area shortly after the shooting with possible connections to the case. Police Chief Kim Braden spoke at today's rally against gun violence in the city. Zion Gibbs is a, a great tragedy for our community and out here to support Myra today and what she's trying to do to help remember him and bring awareness to gun violence. I think it's key for our police department to be a part of this event. We're told Zion was killed while playing video games. In his memory, his mother had this portable gaming trailer set up at the rally outside their home. How do you want everybody to remember your son? I love you guys. He always said that. He said that to everybody he came in contact with. He said it to us every night before he went to bed. So this is an ongoing investigation. Anyone with information should contact the Fayetteville Police Department. In Fayetteville, Gilbert Bay's WREL News.